<laughs> That's so stupid, bro. That's so stupid. That was a stupid make. I mean, I made it, but that was... Bro, I'm so sick of this. Welcome back to another video. Today is Saturday the 15th. This is going to be dunk progression number 155. I know you think that's kind of cool. Look at that, man. Without a finger? Oh my god. Anyway, it's going to be dunk progression number 155. Um, I'm feeling good today and I actually get to use my new microphone, so I'm very excited. So I'm already a little warmed up. I'm going to keep warming up and um, we'll soon get started with the session. You can see this bucket. Ready for this? Come on now. <laughs> Come on. I would get absolutely cooked in any kind of like pro basketball scenario because my jump shot is unbelievably slow. <laughs> Bro, how did I almost, what? I almost tripped myself up. I'm still a bucket though. I tried to shoot it quick. All right, so something I'm deciding to do um, is I'm gonna start playing basketball more, like actual basketball. So every other week, I'm gonna try my best to actually like either play pickup or 1v1 somebody. Uh, mostly because I loved basketball before dunking and I wanna get back into playing basketball. So every other week I'm gonna try because it really just depends on my availability, which I'll be here in the Saturday, on Saturdays. I'll be here regardless. It's just getting other people here to either play or play pickup with. Um, so I'm gonna try and do it every other week. So that means you guys are only going to see two dunk sessions in a month and two like hoop slash 1v1 sessions in a month also. So we're gonna try it and we're gonna see starting next week. Oh my gosh. Low effort though. This is like a baby jump. Just a little baby jump. Just a little baby jump. Little baby jump. All right. I'm gonna jump just a little bit harder. So it's gonna be, it's gonna be like toddler jump instead of baby jump. Jumping a little bit harder. I've been kind of quiet these last couple jumps because I've been feeling that pain in my hip flexor in a little bit of my IT band. So I think it's because I didn't spend enough time warming up these specifically. So I'm trying to take it as slow as I can and gradually warm them up because I'm not feeling it as much now. Easy. There we go. That's better. I didn't like it. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> the beats finally came off. Oh my God, dude, they slammed and hit the ground also. My God. Still sound okay. Oh my gosh, bro. I'm cool. I'm here just for show. Like, <laughs> my God, bro. Literally, what? <laughs> That's 
so stupid, bro. That's so stupid. That was a stupid make. I mean, I made it, but that was, bro, I'm so sick of this. I can never hold it in this hand when I do that. Can never hold it. I just can't put the ball in the hole. Should have called it quits like 20 minutes ago. I'm not gonna lie to you. Um, anyway, it wasn't that bad of a session. Um, in terms of technique, it was horrible because I couldn't make a dunk to save my life. Um, I felt good jumping. Like I said, I didn't take enough time warming up, so I felt some like soreness and a little bit of pain in here. Um, it gradually went away, but as much as I jump today, I'm not gonna. I'm. <laughs> I know I'm gonna feel it tomorrow. So, but theoretically. This coming up weekend, if I do play basketball, it's not going to be as much strain on my body because I'm not going to be jumping as hard as I can for like an hour straight. It's going to be like bursts of that uh, maximal output. So it should theoretically be a little bit easier on my body. It's going to be more of cardio and endurance. So we'll see how that goes if I'm able to play basketball next weekend. I tried Echo Vision's Outcast pre-workout as my form of energy today. Um, overall, I felt the energy, like I had the energy um, I felt a little tingle from the beta alanine. Um, overall, like I think it, it definitely pre-dunk session, I don't know. I'm probably gonna use it for my dunk sessions because I already have OB Mix for my actual workouts. So I'm gonna use Outcast for my, um, my dunk sessions. So definitely recommend it. And if you guys want EchoVision products, if you wanna try out Outcast or OB Mix, go to EchoVision and use code FROSTYFLIES10 for 10% off because it helps you and it helps me. So I don't know why you wouldn't do it. Um, first official session with the mic i think it was pretty well or it went pretty well um it's just this mic isn't as sensitive so i have to kind of speak up a little bit so you guys can hear me but um yeah overall in terms of energy in the session it was there um technique not so much but you know it is what it is probably going to regret this over the next couple of days don't do what i did and jump for like an hour and a half straight because that's basically what i just did um so we'll just have to see how this uh following week goes and if I'm able to play basketball on the weekend. Anyway, if you guys enjoyed, leave a like, subscribe, turn on the bell so you guys want to upload. If you guys are interested in getting coached by me, all my coaching information is in the description below, including in-person training if you live in central Alabama. So please feel free to check out those links and hit me up because I would love to coach some of you guys. Um, other than that, that's basically it, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.